Big Fat Man Scoop, Crook the Clan. What's up, y'all? This is Fat Man Scoop. And right now, you're watching the Sensei, the number one, the king, my dude, Big Brando. He taught me, personally, me, Fat Man Scoop. All you gotta do is keep your mouth closed and your ears open. Listen to the man talk. That's knowledge personified right there. And I wouldn't trust nobody else but my dude, Big Brando. And I said it. Batman school, Big Brando, let's go! Setting there, buddy, boy Big Brando, and today let's talk about shipping supplies. So I got a bunch of orders that I gotta fold up and ship out, so we'll go through that whole process, but I did wanna touch on some of the supplies that I use because this is a common question that I always get, and it's what size poly mailer should I buy? What size clear poly bags do you use? What size should I buy? I bought the same t-shirt folder and same bag size as you, and it doesn't fit my t-shirts, and blah, blah, blah. So I wanna address all of these questions in one video. So first things first, all t-shirt folders are not the same. There's a lot of different ones on the market. Just because both of ours are blue, doesn't mean it's the same. Second thing, just because I use a certain size does not mean that that's the standard size that everybody's supposed to use. All I did was I folded my t-shirt with my t-shirt folder. I measured the t-shirt and then I bought bags made for that. Those bags happen to be nine by 12. Can you see that? It's a clear bag, but this is a nine by 12 clear poly bag. So for the people that are confused on how that works, let me put the camera down and show you exactly what I mean. All right, since everybody's been asking what size clear poly bags they should buy or what size poly mailers they should buy, this is how you figure it out. Fold your t-shirt up, whether you fold it by hand or if you fold it using one of these t-shirt folders right here. Once you have it folded up, take a ruler, any standard regular ruler that your kids have laying around, that you have laying around, or a tape measure, whatever you have to get. And then you measure what this t-shirt size is. So this is nine inches across by 12. So now you know to buy nine by 12 clear poly bags. Does that make sense to anybody out there? Fold up your t-shirt, your tank tops, your hoodies, whatever you are shipping to find out what size bags you should buy. Fold it up, measure it, and then buy the bag for that size. All right, now that you've seen how I measure my t-shirt to buy the correct size bag, which brings me to the other questions that I get, and it's more of a complaint when people say, I bought the same folder as you, same size bags, and my t-shirts don't fit. This folder right here is called a flip fold. I think that's the brand name, if you could see that. That's the flip fold. After I fold my t-shirt, it comes out to nine by 12. Sometimes people's folders might come out to like 10 by 13. Some other people's stuff comes out to like 12 by 10 or whatever the case is. Fold your shirt up, measure it, and then you buy the bags made for those measurements. It's pretty easy to jump on Amazon and just look up clear poly bag. If you looked up clear t-shirt bag, it's gonna bring up a standard one of like nine by 12. And if your folder doesn't fold to nine by 12, your t-shirts aren't gonna fit correctly in there. So buy the folder, measure the shirt, and then buy the bags after to fit that size t-shirt. See what I mean? Same goes for hoodies. I don't use the flip folder to fold up hoodies. I just fold them by hand. But usually what I do is I fold it and then I measure it to make sure I have a bag big enough to fit that size hoodie. That's all you have to do also, all right? And this works for tank tops, hoodies, crew necks, t-shirts, women's shirts, all of that stuff. Do not just go based off of what I use. Use the information that I share as a starting point and then tailor it to fit your needs. Next up is poly mailers. People always ask about poly mailers. You can buy these on Amazon. I have them linked in the description. Same with these bags, I have them linked also. Same with the folder. I have this linked also and all of it can be purchased on Amazon. The shipping supplies link in the description box takes you to Amazon. If you have an Amazon Prime account, even better. Then you get it shipped to you in like a day or two. So the poly mailers that I use is 12 by 15. So this right here will fit three to four t-shirts folded up nine by 12 like this inside of here. This will also fit a hoodie. It'll be stuffed in there, but it'll fit. But say if somebody wanted to buy t-shirts and hoodies and you had a lot of stuff going in there, then all you do is just buy a bigger poly mailer. That's it. It's not the end of the world. Just buy a bigger size poly mailer. And these things come in packs of 100 for pretty cheap. So it's not that big of a deal. Now that we got all of that out the way, let me show you the process on how I fold shirts, bag them up, everything that comes in the package when you order something from myself. So I'm gonna move the camera down, show you guys that process now. All right, here we go. There's a t-shirt. We're using all style t-shirts, by the way. T-shirt goes face down, fold up the excess on the bottom, flip it over, 
done. Now you take this t-shirt right here, and it goes into the clear poly bag. Once it's in there, I also throw in some stickers into the clear bag. Seal down the glue strip, done. So this customer ordered two t-shirts. They got this one and they have this one right here. Front, back. Lay it down. Fold up the excess on the bottom. Clear bag. Nine by 12 slides in there nice and easy. Stickers, glue strips. Here's the customer's two t-shirts. Poly mailer. Shipping label. Done. All right, there you have it. So if you got any questions about how I ship stuff out, I pretty much explained everything in this video for you. But if you do got any questions, make sure you leave it in the comments. Follow me on Instagram, Big Brando TV, and catch you guys on the next one, man. Yeah.